Hello, my name is Debbie. I often find that people are unsure what they should write when it comes to personal statements. In my podcast, I'm going to be talking about developing a personal statement for a job application. It will talk about the basic elements found on most job applications and prompt you to audit your skills to fit in with the elements of job specifications, which are usually knowledge and abilities, communication skills, working with others, problem solving skills, and working to tight deadlines. The most important thing when you're drafting is to use positive verbs throughout your personal statement. These could include planned, developed, supervised, administered, created, designed, discovered, diagnosed, evaluated, promoted, selected, explained, distributed, resulted, completed, achieved, evaluated, managed, selected, negotiated, analysed, tested, monitored, assessed, advised, taught, conducted, solved, calculated, responsible for. This then gives the reader a positive idea about the person you are. When you're writing a personal statement, always brainstorm ideas. Link your ideas to the job specification, draft the ideas, write your statement, making sure that it is precise and to the point. During the writing stage, consistently ask yourself, how did I do it? Why did I do it? When did I do it? You might be looking for a new type of job. For example, a bit from a builder to a salesman, a shop assistant to a nursery assistant. All of these things have something in common with knowledge, abilities, communication skills, working with others, problem solving skills, working to tight deadlines. The most important thing to do is demonstrating how you've used these skills in your current or past jobs and how they would fit in well with the job you are applying for. For example, I worked as part of a team because the work I was doing needed to be completed in accordance with health and safety standards. Number two, how did, how did I work as part of a team? I contributed towards team working through negotiation, which is the most effective and efficient way to use the job to get this job done. Through negotiation, which was the most effective and efficient way to get the job done. Number three, I did this job in 2009 whilst working for and give the company. Always give at least one example of how you accomplished a particular task throughout your writing. Always give at least one example of how you accomplished a particular task. Always give at least one example of how you accomplished a particular task whilst writing your personal statement. Remember the most important points are brainstorm, draft and write. Now go sell yourself and that's all from me folks. Happy writing. We'll follow this broadcast up with more specific examples at a later date. That's all from me. Goodbye, Debbie.